Hey guys, this is Astroneer56, and today I'm going to show you how to get full craft. So first things first, we got to get the essentials done. Now, if you if you already have Java and Twitch installed, then skip to this timestamp that I have in the video. So the first thing that you want to do is I'm going to come over to Java. And then what you're just going to want to do is click the Java download. Agree and start download. And it's going to start the download down here. All right, once you have that done, just open it. Just click install. Alright, now once that's done, you should get this screen right here. Successfully installed Java. Alright. Now we're going to install Twitch. Now the reason you have to install Twitch is you need the little mods tab. So all you have to do, if either if you're on Mac or Windows, just click download for either one. And once that's finished downloading, click open. And then come over here to the top and click mods. And if you don't already have Minecraft installed, it would be, it's going to be kind of grayed out, but just click Minecraft. And once that's finished, click it. And I have three of these because I failed twice. So just go to Browse Mod Packs, look up Fullcraft. Oh. Okay, Fullcraft 3, that's what you want. Don't click the plat don't click the install. Just click the outer things of it. And now come over here to versions. And what you want, if you want to play on a server, you need 1.6. But if you don't care about a server and you just want to play by yourself, go ahead and get 1.7 hotfix. But I'm playing on a server with my friends. So I'm gonna download the 1.6. So all you need to do is just click the install button on 1.6 and if you click my mod packs again it should be installing. I'm going to cancel that download since I already have one. Once it's finished downloading just go ahead and click the play button and it should start up here. So as you can see Fullcraft is right here and if you do start it up and it crashes every time you try to start it up. What you need to do, come to installations, go to full craft and click the three dots. Click edit. Come down to more options. And you see the XMS down here. Change the XMS 3228 to, we'll say, 6000. Now, basically what this is, is how much RAM you're putting on it. And then I ch change this to 500. That'd be it. Okay, and then go ahead and click save down here. Now, when you've done that, click play. Once that's finished, you should get a screen like this. Food craft. And that's pretty much it for this tutorial. If you've enjoyed, make sure to like and subscribe for more videos like this. And see you guys later.